get there, you're really going to need to take on the insurance industry as well as the drug companies. And you have to do it directly, first by getting money out of politics. I'm the only presidential candidate who has a comprehensive transformational approach to getting money out of politics through publicly funded elections um, and to have clean elections so that you can go at the root of the political corruption. So, and that's step one. Step two is let everyone buy into Medicare at a price they can afford, four or 5% of income, something like that, so that you drive competition, competition with the insurers. Let the insurance companies try to compete. I don't think they will. They've never lowered their prices. They don't believe in serving patients first. They believe in serving profits first. And then second, after a few years of transition, most Americans are gonna buy in because it's higher quality and it's gonna be more affordable. Then your step to single payer is really short. And that's when you can ask everyone to buy in, just like Social Security, making it an earned benefit and guaranteed for everyone. Because the reality is, no matter where I travel in this country, the biggest fear is not having access to health care. Of every mother, of every father, of every community, just imagine how crippling it is if your child is diagnosed with a disease and you know you won't be able to afford what the insurance company's gonna make you pay. Imagine the fear, the terror you are feeling that you cannot protect your own child. That is what millions of Americans feel every day. And when President Trump attacks pre-existing condition coverage when he attacks the ACA, he's literally creating anxiety and fear across the country. So as president, I will guarantee Medicare for all, I will guarantee a single payer system, and I know how to get it done. Thank you so much. Thank you for being here. Thank you. Thank you. Nation, please.